this matchup tonight, it's, it's a substantially easier night for our champion as he doesn't have to worry about his title being on the line. Oh, oh, oh dear God in heaven. <laughs> that, that can't be good for Stoneman. That can't be good for anybody. He killed him for <laughs> real with that. How's that? Misfits, you've seen Melvado jump from every corner of this ring. You've seen me lay down every opponent single-handedly. Yeah. But tonight, when the Misfits get together, we are unstoppable. That's right, and tonight, we're gonna show Marvelous Destiny and everyone here in Lansing just why you don't mess with the best in the Midwest, we spirits! Chris Malvado, the ominous Ramirez. We have only seen you in singles. Today we will see you together. Are you, are you going to argue that that is the primary package of the Midwest Misfits? That is the primary package, and honestly, that is the only package when you get with the Misfits. We are here to show up for Lansing, and we are here to claim CPW for our territory. Midwest Misfits! 
Anyway, let's hear it from Alvaro and Ramirez. Enjoy the Great Lakes Professional Wrestling Showcase, please join our Patreon. Visit patreon.com slash American Lucha Libre and become a patron. Get access to entire events as soon as they're edited. Buy access to individual events. Join the two tickets tier to get monthly event tickets and access to videos. If you can't make it to ringside, this is a great way to see all the action and support Capital Pro Wrestling. Our next contest is a singles contest scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, representing Team Honey Badger, accompanied to the ring by Alex Steele, Conrad Lopes. Coming to Capital Pro, facing off with Team Honey Badger. That's uh, that's not an easy draw for any newcomer. Facing off right now. Hey, I don't know anything about newcomer duality. Yeah, this is our first time seeing him. It's, he must have something if Conrad Laux is uh, not just jumping on him immediately, right? Ooh. You know, exchanging chops with the striker, that's a dangerous game he's playing. Getting a little flashy. Isn't about trading them, we're about just giving them out. <laughs> Blocking the hip toss, going with an arm drag. Yeah, Conrad Lauchs is primarily a striker, but can grapple, like isn't above it. Smart, smart. Conrad's had enough of this. Coach, Coach Hodgson would definitely recommend stop, regroup. You, you are 100% there, right there, Craig. 100% right there. Uh, their coach, their captain, CJ Hodgson, firm believer in exploiting every every uh, advancement that you've got. Conrad Louts. Missing with that elbow. I've got to say that's well scouted by Duality. Oh, that's Alex Steele on his side there. Well really scouted really. by Alex Steele. Yeah. Duality knew what was coming, but still couldn't stop it with the numbers advantage. Team Honey Badger. Yep. I was pressing everything. Conrad with the choke. Showing off his push up form. Yeah. Some very nice looking push ups. <laughs> Those were some good push ups. The, the blatant choke on Duality's throat was just a nice, nice side bonus. 
nice side hustle on that that in match workout. Conrad with the choke, explaining a uh, bit of mansplaining the fine points of wrestling to our referee. Yeah, I, I, I want to make the choke, but it's just not worth the heat. <laughs> Conrad Lout. Now, now getting to press that striker's edge that he likes to so much. Oh, speaking of edge, the edge of that boot. Chipping the back of the neck of duality. O only a two count. Our referee Christy is calling right down the middle. She's doing a heck of a job. I am. I'm not. I, did you even see that foot choke by Conrad Lout? If I'm used to his behavior, and he still snuck that past me. I don't. I don't know if I should be in, offended or impressed. He, he's. I, I'd be impressed. He's very sneaky. He's a slick, yeah, slick Al combat. Alex Steele rolling him back in the ring. Conrad Lux cannot win this match outside of the ring. Well, he could by count out, but he doesn't want that. I don't think he does. He definitely wants to punish anybody for stepping in the ring with Team Honey Badger. Like Conrad Lux, not enough to just get the win. He's looking to break the spirit of the newcomer. Knee strike breaking that spirit right through the cheekbone. Oh, drapes him out over that rope. Oh, driving his head down to the mat like yeah, that. That is, there is no name for that. That's just a head spike. But he still kicks out. Conrad has given duality no real opportunity to get back in this match since Alex Steele held him up by re-entering the ring several minutes ago. And Conrad looks to be in tremendous fighting shape right now. Yeah. And just coming out of a, of a, I believe it was a Muay Thai tournament. I don't want to check my notes. I know it might have just been regular MMA. CJ Option. Preach is a multidisciplinary approach. I don't want to misspeak, but I do know Conrad Lauchs just competed in a substantial fighting tournament. Did very well representing Team Honey Badger. Oh! Duality with that Canadian Destroyer. Double exposure, probably. Double That's what I call it. The double exposure. Modified Destroyer. He Kinda caught like it. Code red. Yeah, like wipes him out. Alex Steele, though. Can't get the pin. Look at that. Laux. Laux capitalizes. He's got a choke. Right, yeah. Not a DDD. No, go for the choke. Duality. Duality's out. Representing Team Honey Badger, fresh off of a submission victory, Conrad Laux. Conrad, that was a that was a big win. Do you want do you want to talk us through what just happened? What it was we just saw there? <laughs> Mr. Dangler, what do you want me to say? I just, I just want you to explain to these folks what they just saw. Enough. enough. Do you want me to come out here and say? how we just won another clean match? You want me to come out here and say how Team Honey Badger has been dominating the singles and tag division for years, and we still are not any closer to our tag team title shots? 
How have we been the number one contenders since the beginning of the year, and the purge still hasn't accepted our match? You know what, Alex, talk to them all. I don't care. <laughs> I'd be glad to. Listen, the purge knows something that everybody here already knows, that nobody can beat Team Honey Badger. They're scared. Instead of coming to us for our rightful shot at the Tag Team Championships, they got to go and try to sign a match with a couple of rookies. Now that's just fine. We are just as adept at singles in the competition as in we are in tag team competition, and I'm gonna prove it when I go one on one later today against Billy Ray Daniels. Word around the world, grapevine is that you're trying to institute a little bit of a comeback, huh, cowboy? Well, I'm gonna put a stop to that and shut that down like consumers' energy. Boom goes the cannonball. Ladies and gentlemen, Team Honey Badger. Next week on the Great Lakes Professional Wrestling Showcase, the Super Junior Weight Championship is on the line. The proprietor of the Fledge, Jerry Norris, makes his professional wrestling debut after an impressive amateur wrestling career. His opponent has been champion for over two years running. Can Jerry defend the honor of Lansing? Or will Jason Blazin mark another notch on his belt? We'll find out next week on the Great Lakes Professional Wrestling Showcase.